Having a university degree will help you land more interviews and get your first job. But is that really true in practice? Well, let me share with you how my master's degree actually prevented me from getting a job. So this was probably six years ago. I had just graduated from my master's degree in international relations and I had been living and studying in Portsmouth until then. At the time, there weren't really a lot of vacancies for graduates like myself. So I decided to switch the city and move in Reading, which is closer to London. And in the Reading area, there were a lot more companies headquarters, offices, a lot more places and vacancies you could apply for. And I do the usual thing, I create a CV and on there I put my bachelor's in finance and banking and my master's degree. And since it was my first graduate job, I wanted to have as many options as possible. So I went online and started applying for everything that was relevant to my expertise. And for two weeks, I applied for 50 jobs. Yes, five zero. And from most of those 50 jobs, I didn't heard back from. No email, no rejection, and from around 15 of them that I did get a rejection from. And you can't possibly imagine why they rejected my applications. It was because I was overqualified. According to those emails, I was overqualified for the job I was applying for, even though I had no previous experience. They said they were looking for entry-level candidates and for some reason they thought I wasn't. And knowing that on my CV I had no previous graduate job experience, I found it really bizarre. So I asked them what did overqualified mean and they came back saying that it was mainly because of my master's degree and I was indeed applying for entry level positions for graduates, for people that were just out of university. So I wouldn't see a logical reason why my master's would pose a problem. So what I did next was really counterintuitive, I just removed the master's from my CV. And now that my CV depicted me as a bachelor's graduate, I applied for another 20 jobs. So yes, I applied for 70 jobs until I started landing job offers. And now that I had applied for another batch of 20 jobs, this time with the updated CV, just with the bachelor's degree, I started to receive phone calls for interviews. So I did several interviews and I got four job offers, which is pretty much 20% out of the second batch of applications. And the 20% success ratio of job offers from applications is a really good ratio. So I accepted one of the job offers and officially started my career. But question is, is a master's degree really beneficial for getting a job? I'll tell you what else is beneficial, to click like and subscribe. And also watch this video up next. I'll see you over there. Bye bye.